Introducing the OP24B Remote Control Panel. In this video tutorial, we will show you how to work with the OP24B Remote Control Panel. Step 1. Connecting and loading the OP24B Remote Control Panel. Connect the Remote Control Panel, OP24B, to the variable frequency drive and wait until the control panel is fully loaded. Step 2. Description of the Remote Control Panel Main Screen Interface. The status menu displays parameters of the VFD, icons showing the current status, control type of the VFD, escape button, cancel parameter editing, in edit mode, parameter tooltip when navigating through the group, OK button, parameter change saving, change parameter in the status, switch to change the parameter of the task depending on the selected one, speed, frequency, time, current. Search by parameter number, Hold in the status for two seconds. Up, down buttons. Navigation keys. Parameter value change. Menu, right button. Entering a menu from a status. Enter the selected subgroup when navigating through the menu. Navigation button moves the cursor to the right when editing a parameter. Run button. Start. Stop, reset button. Stop. Fault reset. The LED indicators show generalized information about the status of the VFD. Fault signals the presence of the current VFD fault. Standby signals the absence of fault and readiness of the VFD for operation. Run signals the operation of the VFD. To enter the parameter number menu, press and hold the OK button for two seconds on the OP24B control panel and the parameter number entry menu will appear. Enter the value number of the parameter you want in the status of the parameter search and press the OK button to go to the parameter itself. Step 3. Changing the operating language of the OP24B. Go to Menu, Change Language. Select the desired control language, Russian, English. Step 4. Setting up for local control. Go to Menu, then Control, then Control slash Reference. Set the settings as follows. Control Source Select to Control Source 2. Set Control Source 2 to Local Remote. Reference Source Select to Control Source 2. Reference Source 2 to Local Remote. Setup Source to Local Remote Control Panel. It is possible to monitor the extended description of each parameter by pressing the Escape button. Step 5. Asynchronous Motor Start and Motor Operation Control. Start the asynchronous motor by pressing the Run button. From the main screen, press the OK button to change the frequency speed reference. Select the desired motor speed and press the OK button. Stop the VFD by pressing the Stop button. As you can see, the VFD is configured to operate with the remote control panel OP24B, with full control of all parameters, safe and long work. Work with Triol, sell knowledge,